Hi everyone, this is Joe and welcome to another episode of Joe DeRay's Cooks. I have two words. Honey, salmon. Sure, it takes a little bit of prep time, but once you marinate the salmon, you won't be able to go back. With a simple mix of honey, soy, garlic, and ginger, you marinate the salmon for about 30 minutes before throwing it in the pan until the outside is perfectly crispy. Once that's done, you heat up and reduce some of the extra marinade to make it a thick to die for glaze to pour over the filet. Serve with your favorite sides. For this one, I'm using broccoli and roasted potatoes. So let's stop talking and let's start cooking. This is what you'll need. Four pieces of skinless salmon, eight cloves of minced garlic, four teaspoons of minced ginger, one teaspoon of red pepper, two tablespoons of olive oil, two thirds of a cup of soy sauce, two thirds of a cup of honey, and beer. Sorry, the beer's for me. In a small bowl, mix the marinade ingredients. They are the minced garlic, the minced ginger, the red pepper, two tablespoons of olive oil, the soy sauce, and the honey. Now mix it good to combine. Now place the salmon pieces in a sealable bag. Next, Pour half of the marinade on the salmon and save the other half for later. Now seal the bag and shake it well to coat the salmon with the marinade. Let the salmon marinate in the refrigerator for at least 30 minutes. While the salmon is marinating, preheat the oven at 425 degrees for the roasted potatoes. For this, I am using a one and a half pound bag of golden baby potatoes. Sometimes I cut the potatoes in half, but this time I'm quartering them and then I place them in a baking dish. I add about two tablespoons of olive oil over the potatoes. Then I add salt and pepper to taste. And then I add my favorite mixed spice, Tuscany Spice Blend, which I order online. Then you mix it all together real good. Taking a little beer break. Place the potatoes in the oven and roast them for about 30 to 35 minutes or until the potatoes are cooked through. Stir the potatoes every few minutes to prevent them from burning and sticking to the bottom of the baking dish. When the salmon is done marinating, heat the olive oil in a medium pan or skillet. Now add the salmon to the pan, discarding the used marinade. Cook the salmon on one side for about two to three minutes. Then flip over and cook for an additional one to two minutes. In the meantime, check on the potatoes to see if they're done. If they are, remove them from the oven. When the salmon pieces are done, remove them from the pan. Now pour in the remaining marinade and reduce, stirring frequently until the sauce thickens. Now serve the salmon onto a plate and drizzle it with the sauce, serving it with two sides of vegetables. And now, you're finally ready to serve. Okay, I am ready to dig in. This looks 
fantastic. Let me just give you a little shot of uh, the plate here. Good? All right, my taster is off camera. You can hear, you can hear the sound effects. She's right. This is incredible. The glaze is so sweet, it's perfect. I can taste all the ingredients in the glaze. From the garlic, the ginger, the soy sauce, the honey. This is so good. Mm. I think this is like the best meal I've made so far. It's true. It is true. That's what she said. Now I also drizzled some of this glaze on top of the broccoli. So I'm gonna give that a shot. This is so good, you guys. This is excellent. Definitely give it a shot. Let me know how yours comes out. Send me an email at joedoraysecooks at gmail.com. No comment. Thank you so much for watching. I hope to see you next time. Enjoy. Mmm. Mm. Thank mm -hmm. you.